Out of heat then. Kind of saw it, just bounced off it. Fish on. That's definitely a bass. That is definitely a bass. He's well hooked, I think. <sighs> let's go off, let's go off and have a look at him, Kev. No one's gonna catch on the swimming sheet, it was a matter of time. Lovely hit. Lovely hit. Proper smacked it. That's why I knew straight away I knew he's well hooked. Pop him in the pool, in the bass pool. Well done. Lovely colour, isn't he? Beautiful. Lovely dark. I love the dark one I do. I love a dark fish, me. How are you getting him out for me? Thanks, Kev. Am I flashing? Yeah. Thank God for that. There he is. There's the swimish. Sandale swimish. Lovely. Top quality hooks on them as well. I can't remember what I put on. But yeah. Can you do me a picture, Kev? Sweet. Love it! Come here, you. Lift me up so we can get hold of you. Oh, he's trying to bite me, a bugger. <clears throat> what a stonker. Look at him. Don't keep ruining the background. Look at him. Lovely. Smashy. Right, let's get him back. There you go, baby. Gone. Sweet! What each? Rod. Yeah. <laughs> Let's mark that. Good day again. One each on the bass. How does it come off? Oh, that's because I haven't got that clip on, have I? Well, spotted Kev. Fish on! Looking up, gotta get it over these rocks. Can't see it. Can't see it. Oh, he's going again. Going again. Whoa! Get up your book. Oh, he's a strong man. Not very big, but really strong.
Thanks, Kev. <laughs> Sweet. He really strong, he was. Going for it. Hold on, we're, we're really caught up here. I don't know what's going on. Let's get rid of a bit of weed and get the out up from. Come here, I'll sort him out if you want. You want to you hold me a rod? I can test out my new pliers. Hello, little one. Proper mullet it. Look at that, straight through the side. It's a bit of, bit much for a little one like you, isn't it? No, we're going to get you scoop still. And then we'll have it out easy. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at the colour of him. Sweet. Let's have you back over here. Gone. Number two. Thanks, Kev. <laughs> this swimish. That ah, great looks. Really are. Can you check on flashing before I have a breakdown? A big that one, but real good, strong fighting fish. Can't imagine what a double would be like on this rod. I mean, it is a bass rod, and it does it works the lures nice. Uh, but if you see, I think it was yesterday, I'm whether you're keeping up with the, the days of the trip, uh, I had a big couple of over three pound racks on it and uh, it literally bent more than double. And so it's really not designed for that. The power does come in, um, lowering the curve, so it's there. But it takes a little bit of getting used to. But it enables you to uh, enjoy enjoy the feel of the fish and everything. So I won't be changing the rod not anytime soon. If we was all getting smashed up by doubles every week in week out, we'd go for a big rod, wouldn't we? But that ain't happening, is it? If you ever get lucky enough to have one, you just hope you can handle it. Let's chuck it and see. Getting a bit tricky on here now. I want to end up in the drink. I need to have a little look at my escape route. I think I'm alright for a bit. Never fished here before. Walked down at low tide, decided we're going to fish here, here, and here, and then came back. Seems to have paid off. We've got one more place to try. We, we had a look um, where we were going to fish the early stage. This is the mid stage. And then we've got a place to fish if we still want to be fishing later on. Where we've got a little bit of height over some. Uh, really um, rough ground but I'm kind of struggling now to cast far enough winds getting up in my face lovely bass day though not perfectly clear but clear enough it was gin clear yesterday um, I had one little bass off the top as you've probably seen if you're following but yeah, this is a nice coloration of the water, not too clear. It's what we like. Nice and rough and dull. Can't ask for much more. Well, can, a double. Yeah, I'm gonna have to move off here again in a minute. 
keep my eye on for the bigger ones and lean into them. I've got nowhere to go to my left. Get a better, need to get a better position. Shot. Good fish. Good fish. Certainly stronger than the last one. Not taking any line though. Need to keep him up. Get him up, come on, son. On the top. Let's see ya. Oh, Running left. Oh, he's got a big lump of weed on him. He got a big. He was carrying a big lump of weed. Made him feel big. Careful, fuck. Okay, what's the waves, Kev? Wave. Got him. That's near enough. Let's get off here. I was just thinking I need to get off. He will do, won't he? Just drop him in there. Or oh, he'll be fine, we're gonna get rid of him in a minute. He certainly had a go, didn't he? He felt really heavy because he's got a big massive lump of weed stuck to him. Oh well, so he felt heavy. Last one. Am I flashing? Yeah. Superb. Oh beautiful. Who could not love a bass? Stunning fish, probably mid 40s. Yeah, 45. 45. 45. Nah, 45ish, I would say. But look at that. Absolutely stunning. Beautiful fish. Like, good job that's a slammer, because that just got soaked. You ready, baby? Boom, gone. Gonna get off now. Yeah, let's go. Whoop. Chill onto this. Yeah, and then we'll sort this out. Woo! Yeah, baby. <laughs> Last day. Yeah, I well, did keep saying bass day because it is the weather, conditions, choppy, dull, not crystal clear. Oh, is it the glue clip? Thanks, Kev. Right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put this away. While I'm all excited. Well, when you thought yesterday's session couldn't be beaten, it's having a good go today. I'm getting picked up there, don't I? That's alright. That's superb, because these are. You just, when you get a slam like that, it's like. The, the, the lures, lures seen better days though now. 